Betsy. Ah, yes. Hello. She has made it. Good morning, good morning, good morning. Good evening. <laughs> good morning in the evening. This is this is the running gag May. Good morning in the evening. Here is always good morning. <laughs> no matter what. Good morning, Thunder. Yeah, good morning in the evening. Good morning. Good evening. Good evening, good May. Evening. So beautiful. So beautiful to have you here in this you. uh in this meeting, in this uh beautiful gathering. Um just for fun, for no reason, maybe for exchanging beautiful, beautiful words, empty words. Um, about what would you say, May? About what? About this direct aliveness? Yes, this uncovered, <laughs> naked. This naked. This naked, beautiful. <laughs> this naked. This nakedness. Naked. This nakedness. This, this nakedness. mysterious nakedness. <laughs> Beautiful, May. This mysterious nakedness. Um, I'm very curious about uh, your story, maybe, if you like to share uh, the way you want simply to, to just see maybe what happened there in the story or what, what led May to, to this, to talk about this nakedness. Oh uh, yeah, that uh, story. Yes, it then it went back to uh, I you know I wasn't really a spiritual seeker in that sense uh, until there was um, kind of uh, yeah because of a friend and then I I I knew there was someone who called Muji. It's all coincidence. It's all a coincidence. Then I. I, he said you can have a look of one of his videos. Then I, I went. I didn't know who Muji was until then. Then I, so I picked up some short ones. You know, one which was three or four minutes long. The wait, wait, wait! Excuse me for interrupting you. Why did your friend told you to check Muji because oh, she yeah, because wanted I wanted to share? She wanted yeah, to share. I was, I was visiting a friend of mine. Uh, who who was having actually he was the one who was running this samsara kind of publishing the spiritual he was you know publishing a lot of spiritual books samsara oh. is his yeah. so he he is the owner yeah. of this okay. so i was visiting him now i was at the ta on, on table there was a book uh, and was written by Muji. It was Muji, one of Muji's books. I didn't know who, and I was picked up and you know, going through a bit. And I was, I found, oh, can I have this book? He said, it's okay, you can, you can have it. But before you're going to read, you better check one of his videos. So I was, okay, then I went home. And uh, so by watching, by watching one of the, I, I forgot which one, anyway, the short ones, short ones. So I, then by watching, suddenly I had this, you know, this was something happened. I, later on, I realized it was a kind of awakening experience, which at that moment, I didn't know what was happening to me. It was suddenly like I understood what the, the Heart Sutra, Sutra was about. It was like... A, like a suddenly kind of waking awakening a sudden awakening and i didn't know so i caught my friend the one who gave me this book he said what was happening to me i was like <laughs> <laughs> like i was kind of blissed out I okay said, oh, this is awakening i said wow i never dreamed such thing would happen to me <laughs> oh but, but so you you knew about awakening it wasn't new for you no, no, I didn't know. I was kind of blissed out. I was just so happy. And so yeah. I called him, told him what uh, happened. He said, oh, this is uh, like a uh, like, uh, awakening. Said, oh, wow. Okay. <laughs> that was something I never dared to dream, you know, that. So, wow. Then actually from that moment, I kind of became a spiritual seeker. 
<laughs> because then after some some days or week, I don't know how long it 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 it, it lasts, and then it was gone. And I of course I was longing going back. That was wonderful. Like I was uh, I, when I was walking, I wasn't walking. I was kind of floating. <laughs> Beautiful. I was kind of floating around. Okay. Then I started. Then I was following Muji. You know. So for some so years. This, so this this experience kind of uh, yeah. Let's let's. That was follow. like a starting. You know how I started when I okay. became a seeker. So because you. you I, you you think it was kind of it felt better to be floating around than normally walking? <laughs> no, it's not. A, it was a kind of kind of yeah, it blissed out. It's such a bliss, you know. Yeah. Like yeah. I somehow it was the glimpse that probably yeah. that moment something happened, yeah. and then no, that's that me energy probably that moment kind of uh, disappeared. Relax. Yeah. Yeah. Collapse, and then I started. Then it came back, of course. Then I started. Uh, <laughs> then that was big. Then from then, it was my go my dream. My biggest dream was to become enlightened. <laughs> like I had a taste. I had a taste of yeah. enlightenment, and then yeah. it was gone. Oh, yeah. wow! <laughs> then I want to have it. Forever, forever. No choice in this, right? No choice. Then simply. Yeah, yeah. You, you, Beautiful. And before that, I was like, uh, oh, that's never for me. I mean, that's, uh, I don't, I, I never thought that such thing would happen, you know, to so, me. But, but, the, but as a concept, enlightenment was there for you before. You knew about enlightenment. Yeah, yeah I knew. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah okay, yeah. you knew but about it. I thought, uh, who could make it? Uh, yeah. I couldn't be like a Buddha. I said I couldn't. Be like a Buddha. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't. <laughs> and and how did how did it uh, um, played out then with the seeking? How what uh, were you hardcore seeker or what happened? Oh, I was absolutely <laughs> full hearted. I I was following Muji. I went to satsangs, you know, to Portugal. Then if I was if I am into something, then I was hundred percent. Yeah. So for 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 years, then because I I lost, I you know that's the me like was coming back. So I, from the teaching, I understood from Muji was was you you have to transcend yourself, you know, to to transcend the ego. That was my ultimate dream to transcend. Why I lose it because the ego block blocks it. So I. So I was yeah. trying very hard, uh, yeah. working very hard, uh, and after four or five years, it's like um, didn't work. I mean, no matter <laughs> how hard I tried, I couldn't blame myself not trying hard enough. Yeah, you like, you were full uh, on, full on, yes, full on, full on. <laughs> and then then I couldn't go further, further. So I kind of, uh, mm -hmm. you know. And then, then I heard Tony because I was, you know, on YouTube, all those stuff. And what he said is, all oh, what is happening is just, all there is is just what's apparently happening. And that was striking me, I mean, endlessly by that. And then I was like, uh, I, I kept listening to Tony and I was so, you know, that was somehow something was speaking to me in mm -hmm. deeply and it's different like with Muji. Oh, yeah. You know, totally <laughs> different. And then um, uh, later on, I, I knew uh, Andreas and I, I went to Andreas meeting a lot. It was during the COVID. So he okay. offered a lot of uh, online meetings. So I was always well, a lot, quite a lot. Online. This, uh, yes, online meetings. And it was also, then later on, it became very clear. You know, for me, it wasn't a big spectacle happening. Mm. Like suddenly, there's a giant shift. Mm. 
it was like like you like what happened to you like kind of fading little, well well no i wouldn't say away. i wouldn't say so the tear happens uh, for me it's it's quite normal actually nothing happened here but there's simply uh, this uh, seeking energy is not there it's yeah. kind of everything is totally okay i i cannot say for me like you said with tony when he said it's just what's appearing to happen mm. it's an appearance i cannot I, it's for me it's not an appearance you know it's simply appearance is a word for yes. me it's simply what it is and this is enough this is full yeah. on this is booming yeah. you know yes. so i cannot put the, this is like this but just normal normal life maybe you know yeah yeah yes yes and it's funny very interesting so like i didn't have a big story of you know shift yeah like yeah spectacular <laughs> spectacular is happening but funny enough is uh, then I well how, how long ago two years ago I started uh, sharing this message and then this year in September September yes two months ago I was in China yeah I was in China and then I I got I uh, saw those beautiful posts of you uh, oh thank you. I love them yeah and then I had a massage uh, but that massage wasn't a normal massage. That was uh, quite a special technique, very subtle. You know, the one who does it, it's, um, you know, they can feel, they can gently like manu manipulate the, the the bones without any any force. You know, that's wonderful. Something really, yeah, very yeah. subtle, yeah. sophisticated, yeah. old technique. So this lady, she I knew her, and she was standing next to me, putting her hands, both hands. I was lying on my tummy, so she was putting her hands on my back, and then she was kind of saying to herself, out loud. She said, "Oh, now I I, I empty myself, you know, like when she's doing the the this treatment. I'm now empty myself, and then you know, so she, she with her fingers moving on on my." And then for me, what happened was, it was, it's really, it sounds like a story. And what happened was like, everything kind of disappeared, you know, so, so does my body and so, so does she, her. Okay. So, and also there's like, there's no, nothing, nothing, absolutely nothing. Her hands, of course, there is a knowing that her hands was touching me. But it was like a, a air upon air. Yeah. It's not like a, another person touching someone else. It's just absolutely nothing and no separation. You know, yeah. that was amazing. So that, that was like a big Beautiful. story. Yeah, you see? And then here we go. Exactly, <laughs> exactly the same like what's in the Heart Sutra. Okay. And but it's not experience because it, it's always like that. Anything, any moment or any moment is like, it's always like that. There's absolutely nothing at all. May, what, what would you say? Beautiful, beautiful. Thanks for sharing. What would you uh, say this? It's always like this, you know, everyone would say. Uh, oh, then it's over. It's like this and after that. And then, but it's even now. I mean, there is, of course, no now. It's always like that. There's nothing. There's just nothing <laughs> as a as, uh, thing. Yes. Uh, Beautiful. Uh, so it's like many people have this kind of story, like that's a big shift. But with me, it was, you know, it's slowly fading away. And yeah. then last two months, it was like this, this kind of yeah this kind of story but it's only it kind of sh shows absolutely it is like this there's nothing at all <laughs> nobody there is no body no person uh, yeah there is no substance to this no no of course no, no separation absolutely no separation appearance it's like a, yes yes even the appearance isn't real. I mean, that you, that is a thing can never be understood. It's uh, 
can't explain that lady was I was talking I hear myself speaking you know she's standing there but it's not like it's not it's not I'm speaking the the, 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 the words are coming out <laughs> speaking Wait, just not speak. from not from a center right not from some center and then also it's so clear that the body might get sick or whatever you know whatever but uh, there isn't anyone who who is having that body or who can do anything about that body the body is just uh, <laughs> yeah it's just playing out completely without center as you're saying yeah yeah just absolutely free, playing right. out center. yeah Yes, and at the same time, it isn't really playing out. That's no. kind of yeah. It's like uh, exactly. yeah, it's not really playing out. You know, that moment was so so like she is touching me. I know exactly where her hand is. You know, moving, and then like the rest of the body wasn't there. Only that place. You know when the two little surface coming, mm -hmm. but then it's it's like you know it's like a magic. It's like this film when the where the finger moves. It's like there is a little bit surface to be yeah. touched. The rest is <laughs> totally invisible or it's not there. You know, it's so, yeah. That's so. <laughs> so it's the body isn't really there, but somehow it's just. Yeah, it's so beautiful, much. beautiful. Xander, did, did you also had such experiences or? Well, it's it's quite funny because in a way it's it's like I'm listening to part of my story. Uh -huh. um, because there was a similar experience about 23 years ago. Uh -huh. I was to a neighbor and she had a book and it was Eckhart Tolle. Mm -hmm. And I was reading this book and um, I was sitting on the couch for about a week and I was totally blissed out, you know? It was it was like, it, it doesn't matter if the house would burn or, or if my wife would leave me at that moment. Mm -hmm. it, it was like I was untouchable, completely untouchable, really. And this, I was, yeah, yeah, floating, yeah. I was floating on thin air, you know, it at my work and everybody. <laughs> and I was, I was like, I was telling to people, oh my god, you know, this is so <laughs> strange, you know, it's so intense. And then suddenly, I don't know exactly how long it took, but and then suddenly, boom, gone. You know, this was <laughs> it was just this again, you know, just this yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh -huh. working, working and, and just like normal, you know, oh, totally normal irritations, frustrations, whatever, you know, <laughs> whatever was playing was just and then I was thinking, oh, my God, you know, I, I just I just lost it, mm. you know, I just lost it. And then I think a couple of years, maybe it was seven years later. I had a co I had a short episode again, the mm. same, you know, floating, and then it was gone. So, and then and then the story came that I became, in the story, of course, a, a seeker, and and never because there was like you, you know some people seek because there's, the they want to escape. Suffering. For me, everything was oh, there was nothing wrong with the normal, you know. Uh, I mean, yeah, 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 yeah. There was nothing wrong. There was no lack of anything, but I was just interested, you know, what is there to mm. find. So, so seeking mm. came with doing like ayahuasca ceremonies and 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 magic mushrooms and finding a guru and and mm. being initiated in kriya yoga and all that stuff, you know. It did. But it was not it, you know, I wanted to find the truth. I don't I didn't want to escape because everything mm. was already like okay. Mm. And then and then, well, I talked about this in, in previous Zoom meetings also, but so I was intense with the guru and I was doing intensively like like you were saying. Also, my, I was just you know, it's always full on when there's something yeah, yeah, yeah. 
yes. you know, I was in the morning, a, a quarter past three in the night, I would wake up and I was doing two, two, three hours of intense Kriya yoga before going to work. And when I come back from work, and this was going on for about three, four years. And and then suddenly it was just it was just over. It just totally, you know, it was just sitting and tying the shoes and and, and but there was no, you know, it was just simply what was happening. It was everything, and there was no need. There was, and I didn't even listen to to Tony or whatever. You know, there was just <laughs> there was just full on this and this was and it was not at the same time and then and then after that i i i saw some videos of some some mm. speakers mm. which gave me which gave me like um, a certain type of framework to to be able to to talk you know Ver verbalize to, verbalize it yeah, yeah to give it some uh, because this is it's just a framework you know radical yeah, yeah, yes. All, yes. all those terms is just yes so it gave me the opportunity to, to communicate mm. this, which is uncommunicatable it's just no, absolutely and, mm. and and like you're saying also there is no this there is no now there is no, no me there's no you and at the same time there appears to be a me talking to my long and rosa but at the same time it, it's it's happening and not happening at the same time exactly yeah. there, there, there's no way of knowing you know no. that it, it's as real as it can get sitting and watching and and blabbering but at the same time i don't know it's not real it's not unreal it's it's no. Absolutely. There is even no knowing of no. this is appearing as exactly. you know? <laughs> because that is already an appearance. So yeah, that this is this even uh, nobody knows this is no. an uh, appearance. Yes, uh, uh, like Rosa saying, it's unknown perfection. You know, it doesn't matter. You know, and and there was like um, you know anything what may appear to happen or not happen. Like mm. you, the words appearance and all this yeah. type of mm. type of words to express something is just simply already uncontrollable. You know, there's there, there's nothing here behind this. There's no center, nobody in here, no center. Centerless. Yeah. It was no. It's in a way. It, it's such a parent. I mean, it's you know, it's there isn't anyone who is speaking. And somehow there is kind of speaking. <laughs> yeah, the body, I mean, the body is, it's not here. Yeah. What is this? It's some body sitting here, but who knows this is sitting? <laughs> who knows? This is so interesting, uh, sweethearts. I have to share here. So as uh -huh. here, here, it was kind of um, uh, the suffering, the suffering uh led me to this in a way and uh then one year before covid or maybe when covid was i uh first time heard about non duality mm -hmm. and, and i heard it from from a uh, radical non dual speaker who turned then into a spiritual coach okay so it was a mixture yes. i i heard a mixture I first yeah. was very attracted to the to the radicality. No, no, no. First it was no the, the both simultaneously. Yeah, yeah, the yeah, one yeah. which I knew awareness, being aware. This okay. this I knew since I'm 16. Yeah. And um and then uh, the second thing was kind of what is wrong with what is when there uh -huh. is a shitty feeling, what is wrong? I simply I was simply, yeah, you're right. What is wrong with fear? What is mm. wrong with anger? And mm. I just allowed the feeling. It was a practice. And it mm. was quite easy for mm. this character to be with this. Mm. It was mm. not a problem. It took me maybe a bit practice. A mm. lot of emotions, a lot of things came mm. out, a lot of trash. Mm. And, mm. and the system kind of freed. And then 
the resonance with the radical non-dual speakers grew mm -hmm. more and more and more. And I was like, what are you talking about? You know, with, with this, of course, I got it here, but yeah. it was the seeking, the drive to experience mm -hmm. this in a way, yeah, even yeah, though, yeah. even though, of course, I heard it's not an experience, you know, there is no mm -hmm. one already. And then, mm -hmm. then it was like checking again, there is nothing to get, there is no one to get anything. Mm -hmm. So it's hopeless. Just leave mm -hmm. it, you know? Mm -hmm. And it was kind of, uh, 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 uh. And then it was, yeah, okay, just leave it. Who cares? Who cares? Yes. You know? Yes. And this is so without special experience, it's just just joyful what is. Mm -hmm. No need, no need to get more, yeah. to know more, to experience more. Yeah. But there is no here is no controller. There is no choice yes, yes. if yes. this searching energy is going on and on and on and on. Yeah. Or not. He simply was no probe with watching YouTube's video. Watching you, watching Andreas, watching this, this, this. Who cares? I will watch it anyways, you know? <laughs> yes. And this is kind of childish playing. Yeah. Yeah, it sounds like the seeking energy, the motor of the seeking, is somehow kind of, uh, it's just dying out. It's simply like fading, your, fading away. Yeah. yeah fading and and away. there is no no interest. It's beautiful stories. I love hearing the stories. Also, the very radical things, you know, of Jim or, you know. And I simply am very much with Emerson, Emerson way of, yeah, Emerson, of yeah. performing, performing, really DJing the show is kind oh, of okay. very cool <laughs> because it's joyful. It's about uh -huh. nothing, no matter what. This is it, too, uh -huh. you know. And this uh -huh. I really like. And, um, yeah, I simply enjoy it very much. Uh, mm, this yeah. call it what you want. This energy, this yeah, um, this freedom for no one. It's this really the, yes. This this really the absolute absolute nothingness. This really the absolute nothingness. This is so cool because here it's the absolute full onness, the absolute boomingness, yeah. you know? Yeah. And this yeah. this nothingness is kind of yeah. in this story not appearing, but there is no need to to appear. I'm I'm very happy with this full onness here. <laughs> well, if you if you can be happy with something, of course, but you know, it's it's always funny how you how you put it, Rosa. I like it when you say it just plays, you know, there's no wrongness, it just plays mm. as it place you exactly. know mm. if if it's yeah. this or the other way that you know there's no wrong and right or there's nobody doing it and the, mm. it, it just plays freely and and, and it doesn't yes. even play it doesn't even play there's nothing exactly. ready it's just nothing it's, even happens but but yes. but maybe it, maybe it i can i can really see very clearly here that there is no controller here. No, no. And that's why I say it's playing out. Even yeah. though if I think that I am doing something and choosing something, deciding, yes, I, yes. I, sim I simply know, no, it's not like this. There is mm. really no choice. This is freedom already. Yes, of also no, of absolutely no choice of getting furious, you know, yes. getting so totally devastated uh, by looking what is happening, or you know, getting terribly sad. Yes, that of course. All is just full on happening, yeah. and I taking full on happening. Yes, and yeah. apparently choosing one side against another. It is just ooh, simply happening. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. This, this is, and this is so. You know, this is which comes in all the talks we 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 do. This comes always shines. You know that it's, you know, anything may appear to happen. Frustration, uh, yes. liking, disliking, uh, screaming, uh, not screaming, uh, choosing tea or coffee. You know, but it, it doesn't matter. There's nobody doing that. You know, it's just. Yes seems to be happening and even that is already too much to say yeah yeah Be because yeah. already like a, like a position you know who knows that this is happening or not happening to begin exactly. with exactly like sitting here what is sitting here what is oh. war going on you know 
and crying for those who have been killed. It's all the emotions, all, yes, just full on, nothing. Full on, yeah. Yeah. Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. Beautiful. Uh, Beautiful. Um, so let us, let us maybe continue in part two, okay? And, uh, okay, good. I see you in part two in a few okay. minutes. You mean we need to check out and then check in again? Uh, just uh, wait a sec. Just wait a second.